The Action Aid Nigeria has called on the federal government to ensure stiffer punishment for perpetrators of rape and other similar crimes in order to serve as deterrent to people who may want to indulge in such acts. The country director, NAOB, made this call in Lafia, the Nasrawa state capital, at a women's summit on preventing violent extremism among women. He was represented by a senior official of the Action Aid. He also called on the Nasrawa state government to domesticate the Violence Against Persons Prohibition Act, also known as VAP. The summit was organized by the Action Aid of Nigeria in collaboration with Global Peace Development, Beacon Youth Initiative, and the Nasrawa state government was also funded by the Global Community Engagement and Resilience Fund. The people that are more vulnerable to every violence that happen, happens to be the women. And we have seen it play out for the first time in the history of this country, just between the lockdown alone. The Honorable Minister for Women Affairs reported last week that we recorded over 60,000 rape cases during the lockdown period alone. And these are the ones that are reported. We have other cases that are not reported. It is becoming very important that we need to find solution, and solution must be inclusive. Rape, domestic violence, wife battery, man battery are both human issues. And we need to do something which I called the Violence Against Persons Prohibition Bill. I think if with the honor we have to have the mother of Nasawa State in our midst, I'm making a solemn request that she should push, as she has pushed the restart process, that the VAP law goes to the House of Assembly quickly. If that happens, male and female in Nasa will be better protected. 